I want to thank the witnesses for being here. Uh, this is an issue that has the attention of millions of Americans. And hopefully in this hearing today, we can provide some accurate information so that we take the risk of the Zika virus in the United States seriously, but that we don't overreact to it at the same time. Senator. Send so I'm in specimen. Nashville and I'm 25 year old female and I've just been to Columbia and I come back and I want right. to ask, who do I call? You call your doctor and your doctor can test you and send a specimen to the state or city health department and they will either be able to do the test because CDC has prepared them to do so or they'll forward the test on to CDC's labs for the testing. Uh, Dr. Fauci, what is the latest information on whether the Zika virus actually causes microcephaly? The evidence is literally every week, Mr. Chairman, um, accumulating and getting stronger and stronger. There are definitive proof will come from case control and cohort studies. How long should a woman wait to get pregnant if she has tr recently traveled to an affected area? But we're saying that in general, approximately a month is a reasonable time, but we don't want to say that with a degree of definitiveness until we actually get more data. Okay, thank you. What about a husband who travels to an affected area and comes back? How long should a husband and a wife wait before, or a man and a woman right. wait before a woman becomes pregnant? We do not know how long the virus can sequester in the serum, so in order to be completely cautious, the recommendation is that if a man comes to an area and might have been infected, even though they don't know, and comes back and has a pregnant wife or a pregnant sexual partner, to essentially use correct and consistent use of condoms for the duration of the pregnancy or else refrain from sex. Into the cat a category that we're really familiar with, which is that we, we, we look for travelers. We identify parts of the world where there may be outbreaks of certain diseases and you recommend certain vaccines. And we, that's nothing new. We, 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 we do that as we, we've done that for years. The CDC website is probably, uh, Dr. Shuket, if, you have, if one has questions, the place to go is probably the CDC website, is that right? Yes, cdc.gov. cdc.gov, and uh, Dr. Fauci, would you agree with that, or is there another place to go? I use it every day. <laughs> okay. So if you want to know what, what, what to do, if you want to, uh, if, if you want to uh, find out about diagnostic tests, if you want to know what where, where you might travel, if you have other questions, CDDC website is the place to go. The hearing.